Okay. So I did from speed only. I got an not so good rank up 2500. Then I actually opted for DRNB. I was like frustrated. Like I had to take up something. So I had to watch all the videos. I bring in all the wishes and greetings from all the faculty members of Speed Medical Institute and Speed Team to Dr. Suresh for scoring a very good rank of rank number 353 in DM Medical Group in NEET SS 2024. Congratulations to you, doctor. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Great. Now, can you uh, let us know what you did from uh, what all you have done so far till date to achieve what you are? Sir, I actually did. I am from pediatric background, sir. First of all. I did my MD from Lady Adding Medical College, New Delhi, sir. So I actually passed out in 2021, sir. MBBS? In between, uh, MBBS, I passed out in 2017, sir. Which college? Shumoga Institute of Medical Science, uh, Karnataka, sir. Shumoga, Karnataka. So in between, I took a gap of uh, two, two and a half years for uh, civil services, sir. I actually prepared for civil services. I could not make through civil services. So after uh, I concluded my civil services, I took an attempt in 2023 in ETSS. Okay. So I did from speed only. I got an not so good rank up 2,500. Then I actually opted for DRNB. I was like frustrated. Like I had to take up something. But, uh, deep down, I knew that I can do better because my, being a pediatric person, studying medicine for the first time, thinking that everything is same. So it is not actually so. Though the concepts are same, but it is become it becomes very difficult to wrap around uh, the concept of those medicines. So I deep down I knew I can do better. So I took another attempt. So now I stand here, sir. I very am good. here just because there are so many people who are asking me from pediatrics, sir. Can we ship to adult, sir? Can we ship to adult, Anta? So I wanted to like this will be useful for them. Eye opener, <laughs> yes, motivation sir. also, role modeling. Yes, Great sir. doctor. Now, uh, can you tell us the strategies, what you did? Sir, uh, predominantly in last attempt itself, I had watched all the videos. In fact, around 240 hours of videos are there. <laughs> so because I had in this inferiority complex that I'm from pediatrics and people I'm competing with are the core people. So I had to watch all the videos. There are people from medicine background who have watched only important topics and they have scored good marks. But for pediatricians, I think you'll have to watch all the videos. Though there, that volume is too bulky, there are no other option than to watch all the videos. I did videos once and I read uh, notes multiple times. Sir. Maybe in first attempt, I had read around the seven times. In second attempt, uh, for plus four or five times. You, if you add it up around, it will become 10, 12 times this uh, revision. What the difference which made from first attempt to second attempt is the number of questions. Like the number of, uh, the more number of questions you solve, the more clarity you will get uh, about the uh, topic. Because like MI, last time I managed MI was in my internship. So unless I uh, take the questions, I think it becomes difficult for me to handle some uh, googlies in the exam. So I feel the questions which made me made the difference. Sir. Very good, doctor. How many questions you answered, doctor? Sir, I answered all to uh, 150, sir. Very good, very good. And uh, excellent. You attend maximum number of questions. Very happy about it. And what is your advice for the future aspirants of uh, DM uh, Medical Group? Sir, I think medical people are very smart. If some pediatricians are watching, uh, I say it's not difficult to uh, go through my adult uh, this thing because all the people like pediatrician can take up uh, DM pediatric uh, groups also. The thing is patient number are very limited, very limited. If you take up pediatric cardiology or if you take up pediatric and gastroenterology, hardly there are patients. I am I'm working as a stent professor now. Hardly there are patients. If you have put in so much of efforts and you are not getting returns either in the form of patients or in the form of satisfaction or academics, it becomes a bit unsatisfactory. So I made a cho choice to shift to adults. Now I can see both uh, adults also, pediatrics also. So one good advice is it's not difficult. If you sit for at least three months, you can make it through. Okay. And one good thing, one of advice that I want to give, don't just, uh, work and uh, study, sir. I think it needs at least three months, especially for pediatric people. I'm not at all talking about medical people. They know better than me. For pediatric people, at least for three months, it is better to sit and study, sir. Very good, doctor. What is uh, that you want to tell and people who have supported you 
uh from day 1 till date what you are today in this a platform sir actually Thank it's you. not about this uh, past uh, one month one year journey since the day i sat for upsc civil, civil services my friends were with me sir through all the, the i take i have taken two attempts i could not make it i taken one uh, neat att- neat attempt i could not make it throughout this journey my friends for the support and i thank my uh, all huge lot of uh, thank you thanks to my friends sir my friends my friends and my friends great doctor very very happy to interact with you thank and you sir once again as a from speed team we want to wish you all the very best and all the success for all the future endeavors from now on you're going to do best wishes well in advance thank you thank you thank very much you.